team news. I know you've had a few away, haven't you? You've had a testimonial where a few have come back. So how are you looking for the weekend? In the main, we're looking okay. We've got one or two problems normally associated with really the internationals and players coming back. So we make late, ass late assessments on, on those players. Um, and how has Jack Wilshire settled in with all his ready up to start? Um, well, he settled in very well. Settled into the changing room and the dynamics of the group. Seemingly, really. Um, I think he's been very bright in training, very good. As you'd expect, his quality is, is obvious on the ball and his technical ability is at a really high level. Um, and we'll wait and see what my team selection is. And how have the other players reacted to having that run of training around the group? I think it's given everyone a lift. I think naturally when you bring a player of his quality and calibre into the group, naturally I think players raise their levels uh, to try and get near to his. So um, I think we've seen a positive impact around, around the squad. And are you managing him any differently, just in terms of injury-wise? Because we know what an absolute nightmare he's had. Stay fit, then hopefully we'll see the best of him. Yeah, we, I'd say we manage all our players in on an individual level rather than a, a group basis. So we uh, we manage everyone's workload um, and make it specific to them. So Jack would be no different. We looked at his data from Arsenal, and of course the main thing for us is to try and keep him on the pitch. Mm -hmm. So uh, we do whatever we can to achieve that. Do you think a lot of it's been bad luck, or is there anything you can do to stop uh, some of those? It's not for me to comment on the on the history of Jack and, and his career. I can only uh, concern myself with the future and what happens from this point. And we'll endeavour to make his stay with us as successful.